Right, I'm going to show you now how to use your Viva MK wallet. And if you just go to your account once you've logged in, and then go to my wallet, then you'll see that wallet top up. And what you need to do is do this before you place an order. If you've got an order on the system, and then you try to add money into your wallet, it will actually delete the order and then you'll have to add it all back in again. So if you know you're going to be putting an order in at the end of the week and you want to pay some money in, then start adding it in before you're ready to do that order. So now all you do is click on wallet top up and then put the amount that you're going to add in. I'll just put £10 here and add it. And then you just scroll down and then agree and then just make the credit or debit card payment I will put one in so you can see what it looks like when there's money in there so now just enter your credit card details I'll just pause this so now you can see I've just paid £10 in on a debit card and it actually comes up as order received and this is why it will actually delete any other orders on the system so also make sure you've chosen the right currency so what I'm going to do now is go back to my wallet so my account my wallet and you can see there's ten pound basically in my kitty in my account and if you want to add more on a different card you can just click it again I'll say I'm going to add a, a five pound this time five pound add it and then enter the card details again and click continue right so you can see now I've just added another five pound so I've got 15 pound balance so basically Viva MK owe me 15 pound that's in my account ready to when I place the next order one thing I forgot to show you is now my cart is empty even though before I put those two payments into the wallet there was things in the cart so now I'll need to add them again so always remember put the money in your wallet before you put your order so now I'm just going to go return to shop I'll just add a couple of products in for you. Just click a couple of those. Add two items to cart. Now, if we go back into the cart, you can see those two items have been added. And ignore the coupon. That will come at a later date. I said, don't worry about that. And now, there's two items there. Proceed to checkout. And then if we scroll down, agree the terms and conditions. And then click continue. And then we'll see what happens now. So you just fill in your credit card details. Click pay now. And then what the system will do, it will take out all of the money in the wallet. And if that's not sufficient to clear the amount, then the remainder will come off the card. So if it's £20 in your wallet, the order's £25, it'll take £5 off your card. So I hope that helps. And uh, let's say if you use that facility, remember, put the money in the wallet before you put your orders on the system. Okay, bye now.